Hello and welcome to this video on the topic of glucometer versus continuous glucose monitor. Managing diabetes is a challenging task, and one of the key elements of it is keeping your blood sugar levels in check. Glucometers and continuous glucose monitors are two devices that are commonly used for this purpose. In this video, we will be comparing the two devices in terms of their features, accuracy, ease of use, and other factors to help you decide which one might be the better choice for you. So sit back, relax, and let's get started. Firstly, let's take a look at the features of these two devices. A glucometer is a portable device that measures your blood sugar levels with a drop of blood from your finger. They are simple to use and can give you a reading in a matter of seconds. On the other hand, a continuous glucose monitor is a wearable device that continuously measures your blood sugar levels using a sensor placed under your skin. The data is transmitted to a receiver, which can be a separate device or a smartphone, and provides real-time glucose readings. When it comes to accuracy, continuous glucose monitors are generally more reliable than glucometers, since a continuous glucose monitor measures your glucose levels continuously. It can provide a more accurate picture of your blood sugar levels over time. Glucometers, on the other hand, only give you a snapshot of your blood sugar levels at a particular moment in time. That being said, both devices have a margin of error, and it's important to keep in mind that readings from both devices should be confirmed with a laboratory test. Glucometers are generally easier to use than continuous glucose monitors, especially for those who are new to diabetes management. Glucometers are small and portable and can easily fit into a bag or pocket. They require a small drop of blood and can provide a reading within seconds. Continuous glucose monitors, on the other hand, require a more involved setup process as you need to attach a sensor to your skin and set up the receiver. Additionally, the sensors need to be replaced every few days, which can be an inconvenience for some. When it comes to cost, glucometers are generally more affordable than continuous glucose monitors. Glucometers can be purchased for as little as $20, while continuous glucose monitors can cost several hundred dollars. Additionally, continuous glucose monitors require ongoing costs, such as replacement sensors, which can add up over time. However, it's important to note that some insurance plans may cover the cost of a continuous glucose monitor, which can make it a more affordable option for some. Continuous glucose monitors are generally more convenient than glucometers, especially for those who need to monitor their blood sugar levels frequently. Since a continuous glucose monitor provides continuous glucose readings, it eliminates the need for frequent finger pricks, which can be painful and time-consuming. Continuous glucose monitors can also provide alerts when your blood sugar levels are too high or too low. In summary, both glucometers and continuous glucose monitors have their advantages and disadvantages. Glucometers are more affordable, easier to use, and more portable than continuous glucose monitors, while continuous glucose monitors provide more accurate and convenient glucose readings. Ultimately, the decision of which device to use depends on your personal preferences, lifestyle, and budget. It's important to discuss your options with your healthcare provider to determine which device is right for you. Thank you for watching this video on the topic of glucometer versus continuous glucose monitor. We hope you found it informative and helpful in making an informed decision about which device is right for you.